we migrate to Vancouver uh, in the 70s, we had no intention of opening a tea shop. But my parents were looking for a place to purchase premium tea. Of course, at the time, all the new immigrants who come to Vancouver, I mean, come to Chinatown to find their comfort food and their staples. But we couldn't find a tea shop. So that's when my father always say, oh, we should have a tea, a premium tea store in Vancouver. That's how it got started. Our shop actually opened in 1984. The new immigrants will be able to find one, as tea is one of the staples. Mm -hmm. So it's like, um, instead of saying hello, uh, good morning, we'll say, have you had tea today? as a greeting. So it is very important to have that as part of our life. Oh yes, as part of staples, like eating rice. It's a daily thing. Even in Uh Among the Chinese community, I believe so, yes. First of all, you have to be able to identify the tea type, and then you will use different temperature accordingly. The tool is the father of the tea, and then the mother of the tea is actually the water. The water is so the temperature. The temperature plays a big part. Besides the temperature, also the type of water. There are two reasons that we, are, we rinse our tea. Rinse actually rinse out any impurity from the tea leaf. Uh, second reason is to open up the leaves a little bit. Particularly in where we are in North America, people are seeking for natural remedy to help with digestion, uh, to calm down, and majorly for um, a beverage that can suit their mood. Uh, tea has many different varieties, different strengths, um, green tea, white tea, oolong, uh, puer, and some can be very delicate, very pleasing, soothing, calming. Uh, some can be lifting and give you a good scent. Um, tea often are used in pairing of different food. So for example, what we are having right now, an aged pu'er, is a great beverage for after greasy meal. And uh, it's a complete sensory experience with tea. Tea definitely has been used as a beverage to connect. Um, in events of uh, gathering, greeting, um, for example, in weddings, the, the new bride will present tea to the new in-laws, and it sets a good uh, harmony in the environment to uh, be drinking tea. It breaks that ice uh, wall between people, uh, and it's very easy to drink, and you have so much to talk about in gathering. Because what do you taste? What, does it, what memory does it bring back to you when you smell the tea? Things like that. And also, more modernly, we use tea in iced tea. Um, a, a, but a good cup of iced tea um, takes good leaves, not just sugar. And also, um, to be even more modernized in tea world, we use it in martinis. Martinis is we use tea leaves and alcohol and mix chicken on the ice to make a good cup of, a uh, good glass of uh, martini. So uh, there's many ways you can use tea um, anciently, traditionally, and also in the modern um, tea world. Yes, um, in Asia, definitely still one of the staples. Uh, of course, um, with the influence of Western world, co uh, coffee may be another ultimate uh, choice of beverage. But tea has never lost its uh, uh, rank in people's life. Also, we drink it because of the health benefit. Uh, tea has a great health benefit, in, you know, such as lowering cholesterol. A lot of people also know green tea does a lot to your antioxidant. All that is unlimited. It's no longer um, just Asian that's true. It's no longer, there's no particular age group anymore. Now people who appreciate complexity, who appreciate fine, beverage. The aroma is what can treat people in starting into tea. And of course some of the like trendy tea shops, those are how people get into that the first experience with tea. Aroma, aroma, they like it. They brought a lot of awareness to the younger generation particularly. Um, most important
importantly, I'm hoping tea culture can be truly healthy choice of beverage. And then um, just hopefully that they are also recognizing and understanding there's a lot more than tea bags yeah. and there's a lot more different ways to make a great cup of tea. Yeah. And don't waste tea that way, right?